Welcome back to my journey down Banjo Road. In this video, I'm going to give you a little demonstration of how I've progressed. This is week three or four, I believe. Could be wrong on that. I'm sure somebody will leave a comment down below saying, no, no, why, Craig, you're the, at this stage. If you want to see me at the start of this journey, just go ahead and I'll leave a card somewhere in one of these two corners. You can click on that. It'll take you back to the original, uh, to the beginning. Anyway, um, still working on Boil Them Cabbage Down. Uh, I did skip ahead a little bit to the, in the book, not practice-wise, but just to see what it was in store for me. He does go on to another song, I forget the name of it, which has another technique. I think it was the hammer on, I think was what uh, he was uh, going to teach next. But I'm not comfortable yet enough to move on to that point. So I'm just going to take my time. Now, I would like to say this about learning the banjo in my research. Everyone said it's the easiest stringed instrument to learn. I beg to differ. It took me about two weeks to play a simple song on the guitar, which had about, I think, two or three chords in a basic strumming pattern. This is a little bit different. The chords are easy. The picking pattern is the difficult part for me. And I don't know if any of you noticed in the last videos, there's a little bit of an issue with focus on the camera. I don't know if there's something wrong with my camera, if it's the lighting in the room, or if it's, you know, probably more than likely it's something with the camera and the camera is going out, which is not good news for me. Anyway, here's my progress up to this time. Let's do a little warm up first. Try something a little different. about my progress for now so remember uh, thank you for watching and leave a comment down below subscribe like do all those things and till next time